What's up everybody, this your boy GFamous92 and today I have a tutorial on how to download uh, Arma 3 Sync. Uh, if you don't know what Arma 3 Sync is, it's used for to download uh, mods for your Arma 3. And uh, any, I guess any mod, I'm not sure if it's any mod, tell you the truth, because uh, I only download, you know, life mods with this Arma 3 Sync. And if you hear rattling in the background, yeah, that's my girl. Anyways, let's get on with the video. Uh, first off, what you want to do is you want to come to this website right here and download Arma 3 Sync. You want to scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page and choose either one of these, uh, number two or number one. It doesn't really matter which one you choose. It's the same damn thing. Um, and this link right here will be in the description. So just, you know, scroll down or click on it. Feel me? After that, you're going to open this thing that looks like this and you you're going to be right here it's going to ask you uh something i don't i forgot what it asked you but you got to set you know to where it downloads to uh i think mine's is set to arma 3 if i'm not mistaken after you do that what you want to do is uh you want to come to their website uh this will be in the description too and you want to go over to, I don't even know where this is, tell you the truth. But the link, all these links will be down in the description. All you got to do is click. These two downloads, uh, you can either download it from here or you can use the auto config. What we're going to use is the auto config URL. Um, this going to be down in the description, like I said. And uh, after you get that URL, you're going to open your Arma 3 sync. And... You're going to come all the way over here to uh, repositories and uh, press on the blue plus because you're probably more than likely going to have nothing here. Like it's going to be empty. You're going to press on the blue plus and you're going to uh, copy and paste that link right here. Once you uh, click import, it's going to show up green. And then all you got to do is press OK. After that, uh, it's going to take you to something to look like this. Let's see. Uh. By the way, this is for critical gaming life. And uh, you want to press on this blue button right here. After you press on that blue button, you're going to press on this check right here. And it's going to check and see if you have any of the downloads, anything. And if you see these highlighted, like either yellow, these little uh, gray markers right here. If you see them highlighted yellow with a triangle, that means you do not have it and you need to update it. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on select all. And you're just going to press the play button. And then what it's going to do is download every, like all the mods for you and everything. Um, after that, it's going to pop up this. Download is finished. Uh, you're just going to click OK. You're going to go back to, uh, where is it? At? Uh, you're going to go back to add-ons. And then after that, you're going to click on mod sets. Uh, when you click on mod sets, uh, you're going to have to uh, look for whatever you download. And in this case, it's going to be critical gaming. And uh, you're just going to kick, click, uh, you know, the check and press OK. Once you click that check and press OK, it's going to it's going to show up right here. Now, to uh, enable to play this, you either have to start up your game from Steam and uh, enable the, the mods by yourself. Or you could start it up from Arma 3 Sync right here. All you have to do is, you know, click on whichever one you want to go play. Uh, I've been playing the fake side. That's why I got a check right here. And this is the critical game in life. Uh, that's what you will see right here. And this is nerds. And whichever one you want to play, what you're going to do is click on it. And then you're just going to hit start game. Uh, sometimes they have the, you know, the servers down here. Uh, but if they do not have the servers down here, then all you got to do is click on this and click start game. It's going to load up your Arma 3 with the mods already enabled. And uh, all you got to do is look for the server and bam, you're in. I don't know what's going on with the white listing or, uh, you know, is it going to be. I'm pretty sure it's going to be white listening, but uh, I'm not sure if it's white listing now. So if you can get in now and I'll see you guys there. I'm out.